that when the, uh, the Women's in Massacre happened in 1898 and ushered in an era of white supremacy and, and what in North Carolina Un autre jour, il me conduit devant cet immense entrepôt abandonné où en 1946, des ouvriers, surtout des femmes noires, ont réussi à établir une section du syndicat d'ouvriers du tabac proche des organisations socialistes qui fleurissaient en Amérique à l'époque. Jim me présente ses collègues de l'usine de diesel, tous membres de l'UE. Chacun décide de prendre en charge le récit d'un épisode de l'histoire de leur jeune syndicat. Uh, in climate weather, that if your county has declared an emergency, um, you don't have to. You have to stay out the roads, or uh, you won't have. To, you'll still have to come to work, but you you can come at a delayed schedule, work schedule wise. We call it the uh, free clinic. It's free to anyone in the surrounding area that comes here. The doctors comes out of, uh, we have one doctor that's already in practice that oversees the clinic. We call him the preceptor. And we have something like 10 to 12 students. We had to uh, petition and rally and had prayer vision, all this, to let them people know that we meant business and that it was a health hazard and that it was important that these people get hired. They need their jobs. Alpha, it was granted. After the company granted the, uh, the paid holiday, in one of the um, conversations that I personally had with, with another employee, and they personally said, well, I'm totally against it because I don't think blacks need another holiday to indulge in drugs and alcohol. <laughs> so. Just because a tree falls in the forest, you don't hear no sound, it's still there. We may not be in chain, but we still, you know, racism still exists, but it does it in another form, you know. And, and the state of North Carolina, there's a lot of things that they don't, uh, they try to push under the rug, kind of speak, you know. Uh, and, and we got guys like Chuck and Jim, uh, They acknowledge a lot of things. They see a lot of things. So they're here to fight for everybody. Just like Martin Luther King uh, want fair treatment for everyone. Uh, fairness on the job. So fairness when you go back home or, you know, so it's a lot of things going on.